Alright guys, I'm going to show you real quick um, the modifications I've done to my Sonic screwdrivers. Just a slight follow up to the video I posted earlier. Uh, I'm going to start with 11's. Uh, I've glued this shut, removed the buttons, removed the springs, all sorts of stuff. So this is only being held in here with uh, magnets. A little trick I learned off a couple videos here on YouTube. Um, basically, I did this, everything that I've done with my screwdrivers here, I've done here at work. A um, couple paper clips in there, or uh, what's left of them, bent to where I can activate the buttons. So, standard, not having to touch anything else. No buttons or anything. Flicks open. Pretty nifty. Um, again, no wiring, just using paper clips for buttons. Simple, low tech, very, very, very low tech. Next Sonic screwdriver, I've only just painted, never, uh, never thought about doing anything else with this one, just leaving it as is, just a little prop. Just as the standard activation there activation there. This one, my pride and joy, is my heavily modded. I've used uh, foil tape on the uh, silver areas to give it more of a metal look. Painted it. Spent a little time cutting this plastic out. What I've done is, uh, you can barely see it, the slider is right next to the button. Therefore, I can activate this from any position. Very, very simple stuff I was able to do here at work. Anybody can do it. No power tools, nothing fancy. Just be very careful because you can burn yourself and you can stab yourself. I've done it multiple times. Um, if anybody has any questions, just drop me a message or a comment and I'll try to answer them as best as I can. Hopefully, when I start doing these for commission, I'll be able to do full-length videos on how, how, I'm, how I've been able to do it. Thanks for watching.